you know what time it is. It's another, it's another walkthrough. First things first though. I, I don't want to, um, I don't want to turn down the music all the way because I actually enjoy the music. So you might hear it in the background, but it won't. This is going to be my, uh, you know, it's been a minute. It's been a minute since I actually did one of these. Let's get into it. Tommy Vassetti! Ha! <laughs> Shit! Didn't they never let him out? He kept his head down. Helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? We treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town, okay? We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell, even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, Sonny. None of the families will touch that shit. Times are changing. The families can't keep the backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we send someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice quiet slice, okay? Who's our contact down there? Ken Rosenberg, schmuck of a lawyer. How's he gonna hold Vassetti's leash? We don't need him to. We just set him loose in Vice City. We give him a little cash to get started, okay? Give it a few months. Then we go down. Pay him a little visit, right? See how he's doing. Hey, hey, guys. It's uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey, hey, great, hey. Well, uh, I'm going to drive you guys to the meet, OK? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So uh, if all goes well, we should uh, be doing very nicely for ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so they're brothers, okay? One operates the uh, the business, and the other one does the flying. Okay, that's them and the chopper. All right, here's the deal. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight, let's go. Got it? 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s, used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! Come on, get out of here! Okay, I don't know if I was... I poked my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shoveled shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. Okay, so the interesting thing about this game is this is one of the first games uh, I've ever watched gameplay footage of. I think this game came out when I was like in middle school. Hey, pretty thing. I think it was middle I'll school. I was like in sixth grade when this game came out. Maybe even younger. Who knows? But uh, this is one of the very first games I ever, I ever uh, watched my friends play. And which is, which is weird because like I would just watch them play. I wouldn't play the game because I had terrible friends and they would never let me play their game. But, uh, <laughs> it, it kind of got me into watching other people play video games. So, I guess if they never let me not play their games, just let me watch, I guess I wouldn't be doing this right now. But I kind of find enjoyment in this video. I hope I do not get the cop. I know, like, YouTube doesn't play with the uh, copyright strikes either. But I really don't want to. 
there's, there's some great a there's some great music in here and I would like to keep it in if, if possible um, you know I'm just gonna keep it I'm just trying to talk over it as much as possible not on the cutscenes though hello sonny Tommy Tommy it's been too long I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money! No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with! Wait, Sonny! You have my personal assurance that I'm gonna get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm gonna mail you the dicks of those responsible! Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm gonna let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. That phone must have been way heavier than he thought, because that phone don't make that noise. Alright, let's uh... I'm sort of confused by the fact that there's a loaded screen for that. Show me some ID! Is that a mullet, or is his hair just slick back? I don't know. Uh, this game has not, so far, what I think about this game is that it has not aged very well. Um, if you see those little, like, you see those little glowy parts, I kind of got a mod for this. I was hoping it looked better. It looks slightly smoother, but not by much. Whatever. I'm not... I'm not one of those like. Oi, I break for all ladies. I don't really care about graphics like that. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off, drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are gonna come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we gonna do? Shut up, sit down, relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine, and then we're gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen. He's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way, not I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't gonna be a beer and strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go, come on. Who does that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with him? I like this shirt. I'm gonna say this dude... You think you funny? I wanna say that uh, Tommy is a lot more... Very reminiscent of Scarface, I so uh, he has like a temper to him. You want some 
Looks like a tool. Hmm, nice bike. I like how there's a reflection of a car, and there's no car right there. Yo, you better watch yourself. Yes, you Oh, my bike! Man, the brakes, though. I didn't even... Oh. That braking is awful, yeah. Alright. Buenas noches! I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or mental well-being, Mr. Versetti. He's just got a touch of agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Miss Davis! Karamia, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Mercedes? You try living with it. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our Congressman Alex Shrub with rising silicone star, Candy Sachs. And have you met my lovely wife, Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba's star titan, BJ. Always the charmer. I blocked down on him, and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now, I'm looking at some prime... And that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent, lead singer with Love Fist. Yeah, can I tell you, do you know how they play ping pong? It's silent. Let me tell you. It does not involve a battle, <laughs> if you know what. Impotent. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right-hand gimp, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo-intellectual film director Steve, Steve Scott. The throws a passion with the Nipho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. And now, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as if a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Well, the nada, day. amigo. How do we find you? <laughs> Our business is very trying. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz. He's Mr. Cope. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get there. out of here. Sure Actually, take me to the pole position. Drinks. Yo, is that Luis Guzman? I just realized, well, I mean, of course I wouldn't realize. I'm stealing one of these cars. But I just realized that that was Luis Guzman talking. Will you be working for my father? Maybe. Do you mind me resting my hand in your lap? <laughs> Maybe. It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. Sure you will. Oh man. I only got a hundred dollars. I can't even buy I can't even get beans and weenies with a hundred dollars. No, Grandpa thought okay, sorry, like beans and white. Beans and weenies is like 
350 for a can. Like inflation hit this. Inflation hit this universe real hard. Dude. I don't remember all the hidden guns, but uh, I buy one. I think it's important that I uh, say a. Hey. Oye, socio, que bola? Can I switch to? Can I? Can I? How do I? How do I not have this gun? Okay, I guess I just have this gun at all. so interesting. Is it just me or is the age strangely interesting? Okay. Can I just switch? There we go. Hey, there we go. Ingenuity. Well, I mean ingenuity. I mean, right? Ah, well I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it! Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slime ball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. You pop up from I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know why I'm looking am? for some mate. English guy, Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. You Kent Paul? I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. Everybody's a comedian. Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate? It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. That's right, go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? That's one thing I like about Grand Theft Auto. Everybody's. You can't. It's really hard to feel bad for anybody in this situation. The only character I think I've ever felt bad for was like. Oh, I kind of like it like Maybe that. Franklin? Maybe. <laughs> Probably CJ. Uh, Claude. 
Oh, way to go, tough guy. I just ran him over. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh, yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. No need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. This way! <laughs> One thing nah. you gotta realize about this town, you gotta pack some heat. The local nah, gunshot a couple gun. blocks away. Jess ready to kill me. Oh. See, mission accomplished. I'm gonna go see what I can dig up. I'll be watching you, Tommy. Damn you, chicken! See how the same failed? Alright, well, I think that's gonna be it for this one.